Before explaining you the interesting observation in right angle triangle, let me tell you the some of the terms and properties associated with right angle triangle. The side opposite to right angle is called as hypotenuse. The hypotenuse is the longest side in the triangle. In an isosceles right angle triangle, that is, if two sides in the right angle triangle equal, each acute angle is 45 degrees. Area of a right angle triangle is half the product of sides containing the right angle. The perpendicular drawn from the right angle vertex to the hypotenuse divides the triangle into two similar triangles which are similar to the given right angle triangle. These are the some of the properties of right angle triangle. Let me explain you the interesting observation I was speaking about. Construct a triangle ABC with sides AB equal to 4 cm, BC equal to 3 cm, AC equal to 5 cm. Observe that angle ABC is exactly 90 degrees. Construct squares on all the three sides and divide them into squares of sides 1 cm each. Now count the number of small squares on all the three sides. They are 9, 16 and 25. If we add 9 and 16, we get 25. If we repeat this step for the triangle with sides 5 cm, 12 cm and 30 cm, we get similar result. Addition of 25 and 144 is 169. From this observation, we can infer in a right angled triangle, the square on the hypotenuse is equal to the sum of the squares on the other two sides. This is a statement which gives the relationship between the areas of the sides of a right angle triangle is called Pythagoras theorem. This was named after Greek mathematician who lived in 500 BC. This theorem can be proved in another way. This proof was given by Henry Perigal. Hence it is called as Perigal dissection. Construct a triangle ABC right angled at C. Draw squares on AB, BC and CA. Make a copy of small square and place it in the middle of large square. Make the cuts along the side until it reaches the edges of outer square. Then you can rearrange the pieces. All the pieces in big square now fit exactly inside the other two squares.